so glad I did the MSc International Health and Tropical Medicine course at the University of Oxford. It was, I mean, it met my expectations exceedingly. Name it. Is it is it media training? Is it public speaking? Is it conflict resolution? Is it outbreak preparedness and response? Is it stakeholder management, debating? I mean, I was so happy. RCM has really exceeded my expectations. Um, I gained uh, lifetime friendships and I learned a lot from my friends in the course and also I was exposed to very inspiring teachers and lecturers who also like supported me to reach my highest potential. One of the highlights of the course is the people I was able to meet. The faculties are from diverse disciplines. My classmates, more than half of them, they are from different nationalities and backgrounds and I had the privilege to learn from each and every one of them. I wanted to learn about stakeholder management, negotiations, at the same time, how to implement our project successfully. This course has not only prepared me for the leadership positions, but it has also helped me in refining my technical and research skills. This program is indeed an, an intense experience, but it actually pushes you out of your comfort zone and unleashes your potential. It also equipped me with practical skills and tools on research, health economics, and monitoring and evaluation. The course in general instilled in me a critical thinking approach and how to look at health challenges and solutions from a global perspective beyond our own country and regional context. It's such a great opportunity to get a broad range of knowledge and skill sets, to network, to meet amazing people both within the course and within Oxford the, um, and the wider university. My highlights while on the program were the leadership and communication training activities, a strong team spirit in my study group, and amazing integration into college life. The course gives you a breadth of topics and it will really help you understand what the health system is about and how to tackle health problems from the health system's perspective. And last but not least, it gives me hope that we can actually work together to face these global health issues.